Hi guys, this is a quick tutorial on how you can integrate bot flows into your bot using the Flowbot Builder. As you can see, I've created a dummy bot here. It's an e-commerce bot, and uh, many a times you will come across scenarios where you have to integrate a certain flow again and again in your bot. Like out here, I have I've given the option to the customers to you know choose an item and after which I have to uh, give them a medium through which they can you know process a payment so basically I have to create a payment flow now what used to happen is you had to create one flow and then perhaps you know uh, copy paste it again or you know make the same flow again but with the help of bot flows uh, you can just do it once and call it wherever you want in the bot so let me just quickly show you how it's done I'll go here to bot flows and click on create a flow name it payment and ideally what would you want the customers uh, to you know give uh, the, the de details you would want like you know I'm thinking we can ask for their name uh, what's your name for the user the input doesn't really matter because whatever he types gets sent to our NLP engine and uh, it's just taken as an input it's not matched to anything so uh, then we can ask for his address maybe you know and again the input from the user uh, so out here we can ask uh, so we can ask for the card details and uh, uh, or give them give them an option to you know process through PayPal like we give the option for uh, stripe integration uh, which for which you will need to code your bot but for the sake of this demo I'll just go ahead and ask for uh, you know. all right user input and then we can perhaps end the flow here uh, this was just to give you an idea as to how uh, you can integrate a bot flow <clears throat> so let me just end this uh, flow by saying your payment is processed done so now we as you can see the this is the bot flow that we just created and now I'll show you how you can add this bot flow to your main bot so we'll go here uh, we'll click on main and this is this is where we were right so out here on checkout uh, we will just click on link call another flow payment all your bot flows will uh, get displayed on in this option here uh, and by now we will link by now to payment flow or the I can just change yeah, uh, yeah payment flow so as you can see what I did was I created the bot flow and in the like uh, integrated it here on my main bot uh, and now let, let's just quickly give it a try all right wait let me first show you if if you want to you know remove a, a flow a bot flow that you just put so for that you need you need not delete uh, this because this will then you know uh, delete the entire flow here so all you got to do is go on your uh, go wherever you've linked click here 
and click on this icon here to remove link you know so this will remove the bot flow from your main bot just click on cancel let's quickly test the full bot now uh, okay so bot flows can be used to <clears throat> create uh, any any flow you know like you can ask uh, like based on what your uh, requirement is uh, you can ask for many details so this was just just an e-commerce demo likewise you can create uh, demos for uh, you can create bot flows for other use cases as well so out here i'll click on what we want to buy flowers so it gives me an option i click on checkout and this will trigger the bot flow what's your name as we said uh, any input will uh, be taken oh i misspelled address sorry for that and how do you like to pay i'll say card again the input doesn't really matter here your payment is processed so uh this is how a, a bot flow works similarly had i chosen the other option here uh it would have still triggered the same flow so this is this is it for the tutorial thank you